Now, Faye Weldon has had an awful lot to say this week and has also grabbed headlines when she admitted that she believes she has some form of psychic ability. Since childhood, she says, I think I've always known what goes on in people's minds uh, and heads better than probably they do themselves, and it can be quite uncomfortable. So do you think she has a point? Do you think that we all have an ability to read other people's minds, or you, are we a little bit psychic? Well, I don't... I, you see, I, I think everybody's got a part of them that they, they ignore. You know, we, we all go into things and, and you get a gut feeling a lot of the time and you should really listen to that because I think that's your, anim, your animal instinct going, whoa, just mm -hmm. hang on a minute. And we don't, we ignore it and we think, no, because guilt comes in, doubt comes in, how could we possibly think that? But actually, we should listen to that a little bit more. And I do tend to sit back and listen a little bit more. So I, I, I wouldn't call it a psychic, but saying that, I, I probably, I do think I've got a bit of a psychic ability. So have you, have you, have you foreseen certain things that have, that, that, that have happened? Well, yeah, I've, I've done quite a few things over the years, but one, uh, I was working on a cruise ship, I used to work on a cruise ship, I don't know if anybody knows. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, Is that when you live with your mum? Yeah, hey, ah, yes, <laughs> yes. But my mother, it's, it's about my mother, and I've got a certain relationship with my mother that is, is closer than, I, I would say, a lot of people, and I, I do have an, an intuitive, uh, relationship with my mother and she was having an operation once and I had this dream in the night when I was away that there was an uh, it was very grey around this area where she'd had the and I, I just thought there's an infection in there and I said to her can you just for my peace of mind go and ask the doctor to just check your dressing there's something wrong with your dressing <clears throat> and when he did there was an infection in there so that I don't know if that's Intuitive maybe that's or? because, yeah, maybe because you've got such a close relationship. I always think that comes into it a lot. You know what I mean? With your kids and your, your children, I think we know things that perhaps men don't. I mean, sometimes it's just, I suppose I'm a little bit cynical, even though I have to say hypocritically, I have done that thing of going to clairvoyance and going and, and it's kind of like that desperation to have a, a decision that you've made confirmed almost. But I think I've come to the conclusion that it's often coincidence. I mean, there are some people who, you know, they just go, um, oh my God. You're wearing a red dress. I was so going to wear one today. That is just spooky. Do you know what I mean? Like every single thing is based on, oh my God, that is just so weird. Yeah. But I think that sometimes, <laughs> but they do though. I think that sometimes it is just, it is just, co it is just coincidence. Or female intuition. That's mm. that's another sense that shouldn't be knocked. Yeah, because, yeah, yeah. I mean, that's that's certainly helped me um, avoid more heartbreak than is necessary in times. I remember um, I was I was seeing a guy who I was I was very much in in, in love with. And um, I went to see something he was doing at work, and he had lots of other colleagues there. And I, this, there was loads of people there, but for one reason, I don't know why, I just was drawn to this woman. And it didn't matter what was happening, I, I really should have been, you know, at his side watching him. I couldn't take my eyes off her. And, and I knew. Mm. And I knew. And, 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 and I was right. He's married mm. her. They've, they've got lots of children together. But you they've been knew. together, but, but I knew I was about to lose him. I had, I I've had a similar I think that thing. Is as well. no, it is intuition. Yeah, well, yeah no, it's not psychic. Yeah. I think I was with a guy who, who I knew wasn't the most faithful. And uh, I was asleep and I woke up in the middle of the night and just went, <gasps> I need to phone him. I need to phone him. I knew he was out with somebody very close to me. And I just knew, couldn't get hold of either of them. And when we split up, he actually turned around to a friend of mine and said, Yeah, well, I slept with her. That on that night and it was and, and I didn't know beforehand it was like something woke me up in the middle of the night and I just knew but I say to Jake all the time he thinks it's funny he can't say psychic but um, <laughs> he thinks it's funny when I say no exactly what you think he's like no you don't and I tell him and he just thinks it's so scary spooky I'm like I'm your mum I'll always know what you're thinking darling <laughs> you'll <laughs> never get anything plus he's a boy Mm. Plus, he's a boy easy yeah, to read easy well to read, yeah. not they in my much, life <laughs> they are much easier I than wish. us <laughs> okay well we're going to take